A Michigan couple drove their quadriplegic son to Oklahoma so he could go fishing for Spoonbill. The teen's dad even built a handicapped fishing device to make it possible. News on 6's Amy Slanchik has their story in tonight's Something Good. Fourteen hours from home, the Timlick family didn't waste a minute to get out on the water at Keystone Lake, ready to go fishing at the crack of dawn. Don't get me wrong, it is a lot of work. That's how he turns it on and off. William takes his 14-year-old son, Waylon, fishing and hunting all the time. In the six years since Waylon became a quadriplegic, his dad has perfected a handicapped fishing device. How was the drive in? Yeah. It was good. Make sure we hold it tight. With the family's ramp they found at a garage sale, Waylon makes his way into the boat. Yep. Hop on, bud. Yep, keep rolling. Go this way a little bit that way. There you go. It's safety is number one. Once inside, <clears throat> Waylon's chair is strapped down, and it's time to find the fish. This is what we drove 14 hours for. I'm going to be sitting right here with you. Wait, you got one. Here you go, here you go. With help from Nick Mefford with Keystone Lake Paddlefish Charters, Wayland reeled in the spoon built, using only his mouth to power the system his dad built. That's a big fish, Wayland. It's a 100 pound oh, fish, Wayland, your first ever paddlefish. All right, I got I to gotta yeah. release her here. <laughs> A close look at William's shirt says oh it all. Goodness. Those letters stand for where there's a will, there's a way. I'm William, so I'm his will, he's my way. But this way of life didn't always seem attainable. William says a surgery gone wrong changed their lives forever. Waylon was told he'd never get on a boat again. We try not to look to the past, we're trying to look to the future and Things such as this make the future worth doing. You just keep watching that as long as that keeps moving. The family has a busy schedule up ahead with plans to go to Texas next. Hopefully after that winter time, um, try to run some shark down in Florida, maybe Alabama. And everywhere they go. Don't give up on your kids, no matter what. Somebody tells you your kid can't do anything, and no, prove wrong. Together they prove where there's a will, there's a way. See that? Good At one. Keystone Lake, Amy Slanchik, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6. Go, okay?